Today, we also recognize the outstanding TESDA test partners for their contribution to technical vocational education and training through the National Kabalikat Award. This award recognizes the outstanding contribution of our partners and stakeholders in the development and employment of the Philippine workforce. And now, we shall present to you our Kabalikat Awardees. They will be receiving a plaques of recognition. The black reads as follows. Technical Education and Skills Development Authority presents this award to as National Kabalikat Awardee in grateful recognition of the exemplary contribution in the achievement of technical vocation, vocational education and training in the country. Given on the occasion of the 26th TESA anniversary, this 27th day of August 2020 at TESA Complex, SLEX, Fort Bonifacio, Taguig City. Signed by Secretary Isidro S. Lopena, PhD CSE Director General. Ating paparangalan ang mga Kabalikat Awardees na kapilang sa industry partners ng TESDA. Our second awardee is TechVoc Association of the Philippines or TEVSA. TEVSA Incorporated has more than 300 members of private technical vocational institutions. It has partnered with the Certification Office of TESDA in organizing two TVET quality forum events. The association also encouraged greater involvement and participation of the private TVET institutions thus increasing the awareness on the System for TVET Accreditation and Recognition, or STAR, and quality TVET provision among the private TVIs. TEVSA continuously provides inputs to TESDA for policy formulation and continuously elevates to TESDA important matters that may affect the private sector. During the community quarantine across the country, TEVSA worked with other 26 TVET associations through a series of webinars on how the TVIs and TESNA can help each other under the new normal. It also conducted several webinars for trainers and administrators advocating the normal or the new normal in TVET, particularly on flexible learning. The award will be received by its president, Reverend Father Onofre Innocentio.